The American Medical Association has called for a total ban on all e-cigarette vaping products. It comes as Philadelphia lawmakers take a closer step to cracking down on vape sales. Natasha Brown is here with the new developments tonight. Natasha? Well, Philadelphia City Council members do continue to push a bill that would restrict the sale of flavored e-cigarette products to minors. Health officials testified about a rising vaping epidemic in Philadelphia during a hearing today, and teenagers recounted their own stories of how vaping has affected their lives. She is 16 and addicted to something she thought was harmless. Powerful testimony from teenagers representing the Advocacy Institute's Real Talk Tobacco program. If vape juices and e-cigarettes didn't have so many flavors like Candy King's Strawberry Rolls, Sour Worms, Birthday Cake, and Fruity Pebbles, or even pretty colors that stand out to the youth, I feel like there wouldn't be many youth tempted to use these products. This group of young people who also let their signs do the talking packed city council chambers during a hearing on a bill that would limit access as well as the sale of electronic smoking devices in youth accessible establishments. When we look at this issue of flavored tobacco and as well as e-cigarettes, it is purposefully marketed to our children. We are seeing an epidemic of vaping by teenagers across the country and in Philadelphia. What this bill does is would restrict the sale of high nicotine content or flavored products to stores that don't allow children in at all, adults only stores. Councilman Greenlee introduced the bill a few weeks ago as a continuation of the crackdown on flavored e-cigarette products to young people. And this is a forward uh, looking bill and I think it will help these people, these young people sitting in the, in the uh, audience today. While well, establishments caught selling certain vaping products to minors would face fines. Meantime, the bill moves one step closer to passage. It's expected to go before a full city council for a vote in just a couple of weeks or so. Mm -hmm. Keep us updated. Yeah. All right, Natasha. Thanks Thank so much. You.